boy Fifth of Sam. <laughs> we back with another one. <laughs> yeah. Yes, sir. Uh, so this one's gonna be short and sweet, man. Um, right. as y'all know, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm just chilling here with Evie. Oh. And my boy C Breezy. Yes, sir. Your baby. Dog stay breezy. Yes, sir. All right. So, quick one, y'all. Um, as Christians, uh, there are things that we do that's questionable, right? You know how the Bible says, you know, do not be conformed to the world, but be yeah. transformed by the renewing of your faith, knowing that your oh, testimony God. produces patience, right? Um, we have this holiday coming up, man, Halloween. It's a big deal. Especially in America. All right, we have kids going out trick-or-treating, knocking on doors, you know, asking for candy. And there's a dark side to Halloween, too. Remember, like, uh, if we, you know, think about the ancient time of Halloween, it was uh, a, a holiday that was celebrating the dead, right? Um, uh, we're not going into the history of Halloween. You could Google that yourself. He <laughs> 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 could do that chat yourself. Chat <laughs> okay. But um, as Christians, do you guys believe that it's okay for us to, one, celebrate Halloween or dibble dabble in Halloween celebration or be against it, like point blank period? Against it. So yeah, we celebrate. Candy not good for you anyway. <laughs> I have blood pressure. <laughs> candy not good for you anyway. So just stay away from it. I ain't gonna lie. Don't. Don't do it. You know, when you said something about, like, we celebrating the death, I'm like, if we are Christian and then we look up to Christ, he didn't stay down there. He re resurrected. So what, what am I gonna celebrate somebody that's, you know, that's dead when, you know, the Savior himself is alive. I wonder I wonder what celebrating the dead even means. I mean Halloween the itself people. was created by the church, right? And it's it was a way to uh come back the pagan holiday um uh that was celebrated before by the Celts. Right? I hope I said that right. You could Google it yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <Chat GP2>. <laughs> <laughs> um um so but eventually, it, it, it became a thing that was adapted by the world, and they turned it into the Halloween cap costumes and, you know, the trick-or-treats and, and, and stuff of that nature. Still don't celebrate it, no. I'm still curious. Um, what does that mean? Like, to celebrate the dead. Like, like, in that, like, just that terminology, celebrating the dead. Like... What does that mean? You feel me? Like, cause it's like, for example, like I could say I'm celebrating Ivanya for her birthday. And then just go and now spend some time with her, you know, chilling. We're gonna have a good time, have a party, whatever like that. But how do you do that for the dead? Like mm, in the ancient days, so like I'm they, actually curious. They believe that the 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 dead spirits at that particular time roam the earth. Right? So I'm starting to think us humans, but we bored. <laughs> we are bored. We come up with the most bonus God. stuff, bro. How do we know the, the, the 31st? <laughs> <laughs> you, you don't know. I don't know. I'm thinking about the Haitian culture. You know that get it thing? Yeah, they do celebrate the dead. They, they like there, there is a time the where in the Haitian like, culture they celebrate the dead. And as for me the, and my the, house, the Mexicans we shall serve as the well. Lord. In life. They 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 do celebrate the dead. I believe it's around this time now, October. Yeah, I yeah. think I think I think for Haiti they do it like November first, and they do believe I, they I do see those. No, no, the Bible tells us let the dead worry about the dead. Like they they dead. Let them worry about oh. the dead, man. Like like we we who are living, we need to worry about the living, right? So as far as Halloween is concerned, man, it's not it's not something that I, I liked as a child, and there's too too many. Uh, uh, nightmare stories that I've heard about Halloween uh, from kids eating candy and going to the hospital because they overdose on on some substance, you know, uh, from kids being kidnapped because parents sent them out uh, to trick or treat and they got taken, you know, um, like there's nothing good that comes from 
uh, to me, celebrating Halloween. I remember, like, back in the days, like, uh, at the church to come back Halloween, right? <laughs> it's like a... We were standing up in the face of Halloween. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Bro, we came up with Hallelujah Night. Yeah, it, it sounds weird now, you know, but... <laughs> it sounds weird now. <laughs> now it sounds weird. But back in those days, what we used to do, we used to, like, throw out a concert, right, on, on Halloween night. We call it Hallelujah Night. And we have praise and worship. And we pass our candy. I'm like, what are we doing? What, what are we? What are we doing? What are we doing? Like, we passing out candy. Uh, I remember, like, there was one year where we did face painting. I'm like, nah, nah, bro. Like, we, you're not being set apart. Like, we, we, we low key celebrating Halloween. Mm -hmm. They're calling it Hallelujah Night. Since it was at the church, then it was okay. No, nah, it's not okay. I mean, I feel it's like okay. I feel like if that day and the church is like you know what let me gather the youth and then let me do something like worship not mm -hmm. the candy not the painting and stuff mm -hmm. like this eliminate all those by the way like uh, on hallelujah on hallelujah night is when i asked my wife out you know for the first time <laughs> I yeah. so hallelujah night was a good thing I though took advantage of hallelujah <laughs> night <laughs> It's not a bad thing. Yeah. If we can she give said, the you. She said yes. It was a good I one. mean, you said your wife. Don't put your <laughs> she could have said no, man. Like, I could have been chasing, you know, for a while. No <laughs> way, but I saw what I'm saying. So there was benefits to Hallelujah Night for me, all right? That's what I'm saying. That's a good thing. So there could be benefits where you can it. save uh -huh. another youth not going in the street. Because I feel like with the Halloween thing, I think some of the youth. Say that again. I'm sorry. You said we could save the youth from not going on the street. Yeah. But do you think as a Christian they should be thinking about going to the streets in the first place? Come on now, we human. I mean, Jesus, oh, let's not Jesus is in the streets. No, 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 we're not talking Halloween about Halloween and night. Hey, <laughs> Jesus, Jesus, was the Jesus was, and the way that they apply the streets nowadays, Jesus was not on the streets. He was, was on the streets. Nah, my guy was walking in the streets. <laughs> no, he was, he was, he was not in the streets. streets. Okay, that boy was in the synagogue once. He was walking them shit, yeah, but he was on the street. Hey, hey, man. The flesh is weak. We weak sometimes. So yeah. Nah. Sometimes we have to be honest. I'm not taking that. But sometimes we have to be honest. Come on, now we all sinners, and there's time we use excuses. And with the hallow uh -huh. Halloween night, we might use excuses just to go in the street. Now you if are the... talking. Now, now you think I'm not gonna. You know, I, I have not, no argument against so that. So with the Hallelujah night, if the church can come up with something to basically bring the youth together or bring people together and just spend time, it can save somebody's life. You never know. So I, I don't think church should stop doing it, even if it sounds I weird to other people. That's I don't know thing. if it's I don't know if it's me, but I mean lately, you know, nowadays I feel like when it comes to just celebrating holidays, period, it's just, it's been hard. It's been not hard, but like there's not as much Enthusiasm into it. Into you, you're getting older, bro. That's what that means. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's that. Maybe it's him. He's older. Maybe you're getting older. Cause like even, cause it's not even just only Halloween, but like any other holiday, like Christmas. I don't negotiate Christmas, right? Um, is, and the association of Christ. That mean I'm. I'm not talking about the, the, yeah. the Christmas spirit, the lights and the trees and all that, and, and the you I know like gifts concept of Christ. Like I don't That's negotiate so Christmas, but this Halloween thing. Uh, I believe for the church, if they're not careful, like we could be practicing, you know, something that we should not be practicing. So they need to be careful in, in how they yeah. they celebrate this Halloween thing. And then you having your kid dressing up your kids because they are kids. You're like, mm, they're just kids. So I'm going to just dress them up. You know, you who have faith. Right. I'm not talking about the child. You who have faith who dress up your kid and send them out on the streets. And 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 I, I, I would say. In honor of Halloween. You know, <laughs> it, like, I look key, shouldn't be. I look want to play devil's advocate. Go ahead. Do your thing, bro. Um, Halloween, <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's crazy. <laughs> but, but, yeah, like, I wonder, like, this probably, like, you know, probably, the, I'm just thinking on the mindset of probably, you know, mm -hmm. other Christians, you know, or other mindsets of people who probably are not of the faith. Mm -hmm. Like, like, what's the big deal of somebody, you know, trying to look like a princess for the night and just trying to get some candy. Not in that way. Wow, looking like a princess for the night. Wow. <laughs> what are you thinking? My you? mind. What are you thinking? Oh, my mind. Wow. Shout out. 
But anyways, um, <laughs> yeah, but like, what's to go back? Yeah, so like, <laughs> as a kid, like, like, what's the harm in letting a child like, hey man, you know, you wanna you wanna dress like little Disney princess? Go ahead, girl, put your little dress on. We gonna get some candy. Like, like what's like what's so bad about it? Well, I think it's you that that always mentioned that verse, right? What 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 did what did the the, the God tell parents to do? Train their, their child in the way they should go. <laughs> and, and then what? He's and they will never depart from it, my dog. <laughs> so if you're training your child to to apply Halloween as no, you know a tradition, I'm not. It's not. A, it's not. A, it's not the. I'm not thinking of it as like Halloween. Like for example. I'm just okay, I'm before, just playing spiritual advocate. Before before okay, so let's say like let's take out the notion of like just for Halloween. Okay. Let's just say like a random day, like your child wanted to actually look at Disney Princess. All right. Can yeah, she? Whatever. Yeah, she can. Whatever. What's the difference between doing it that and then on Halloween? Well, ha- Halloween is is set apart for for, the, for that celebration. No, but th- but that's just human humanly speaking, people just build correct, that up correct, out of correct, nowhere. Correct. Like so what's the so what's to say like somebody else say, you know what? What today's date? That's like saying, so like, what if somebody said, you know, October 16th, you know what, uh, you guys, this is this day, this is where the dead comes. Or this is where the spirit roams around the earth. This is where the devil roams around the earth. What's to stop somebody from building up some random, you know, um, not, not doctrine, but more so like this random thing, like how they built up the Halloween thing. And then it comes a, a actual, uh, actual holiday. And to say, you know what, in the future as Christians, they can't go out on October 16 either, you know? Like, what's to stop them from doing that? Like, because how I see it, Halloween really just came up because of people. Like, just humans Humans believe that's where the dead came. That's where, that's the day the dead pulled up. I don't know. I don't know why that day of all days, but okay. October 31st is where the dead pulls up. It's like, what's to say somebody is not doing the same thing? And if that's the case, so what would be the difference if, somebody, if your child wanted to dress up as a Disney princess... October 16th and dressing up as a Disney princess October 31st. Like, what's the difference? It is a big difference. I don't know. I'm still going back to how, like... You say it's a big difference. We're waiting on the answer. Yes. There's what I'm saying. It's a big difference because that specific day when they said, you know, about the dead, I do believe in the spiritual realm, you know, that spirit do come the bad. I know you're playing devil's advocate. You're doing an amazing job. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not. This is actually how I'm thinking. This is, I'm, you know, I'm not playing devil's advocate. This I'm man actually, said I'm Caleb's advocate. I'm actually hey, curious. Man. Yes, I'm Caleb's advocate. I'm crazy. Advocate I'm actually curious. <laughs> That's crazy. Because we have, we have to remember, because I know the Bible talk about like, there's a lot we don't see. Of course. And, you know, so we don't know what's going on on that day. We don't know what's going on today. We don't. <laughs> it's also what's what's the, 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 the spirit, the spirit realm does not. That's like, what I'm saying. Dissipate. Ain't nobody got no. no you know, but the spirit realm ain't got no nine to five. And, and, and sixty four days. Yeah, ain't no nine to five in the spirit realm. They right. up every day. It, I, mean, I don't. I don't we, we fighting every day. We fight, literally, <laughs> it's a spirit. Look, it's a spiritual battle every, every single, single day, every second. So what's the difference? Every second. Of somebody wanted to dress up as Disney princess today. And October 31st. Nah, I see your point. Like, what's the difference? Okay. I mind you, October 31st, like this fashion of Halloween just came up from a group of people who just, I don't know what made them perceive. To come back yeah, to Chris, the Christian yeah. holiday. But it's like, we can literally, if that's the case, we can literally say October 16th is the day where the dead roams the earth too, uh, first before they come on 31st. And then it becomes like this big thing where we could grab a majority of people now, later on throughout years, the same way how October 31st came up, October Oh, excuse me. October 16 came up too. So, like, what's the difference? Bro, that's how religion is formed, bro. So, that's what I'm saying. So, it's like, when it comes to just as dressing your kid up as whatever they want, what's the difference of them doing it any other day and doing it October 31st? Because if, if we're going to say October 31st, Halloween is bad and the activities of, of it is bad, then we should not be going out there trying to give people some candy. We should no. not be dressing up our kids as whatever they want to be like. Period. Hey, look, my kids will tell you this. <laughs> okay, they don't dress up for Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> like, look, I even instruct them not to get candy from 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 their teachers. Okay, like, I don't I don't care about Halloween, man. And you know, sometimes people don't like to. Oh, you know, their innocent mind. Nah, my kids gonna know the truth. They know Santa, Santa don't give them gifts. <laughs> like, they know that, but bro, my kids were like two, three. 
<laughs> like my wife was like, no, nah. I'm like, nah, I work too hard. <laughs> 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 too hard yes. for for this stranger to take what to take credit for my hard work, bro. What's no. that, Nicholas? No, I wanted to. No, nah, bro. My no, Mikey's gonna know. Daddy and mommy Doesn't work mean. hard for these gifts. Okay. But to go back to the um Halloween thing, I do. Feel, the reason why I'm saying there's a big difference because I remember being little. Still now, we still go b- about like how there is a time when people want to do witchcraft or like there's like at midnight that's when they send this i don't know it's i don't know i'm not into it i don't know <laughs> but you know when you, know when you pray, I, get, I get what you're saying you know when you're praying they always said like this is the time people be doing things or you have to pray mm-hmm. or when your parents like why you out late because the devil's outside and stuff like this i feel like with the 31st it's like you know how you know how like when we do sacrifice like idols we when I'm they, saying, when, when they, people, when they, you know, when, when people, they, when they, mm-hmm. when they do like, you know, sacrifices, like they bring bringing stuff to the devil or they doing it. You don't know if whoever started it, you don't know whoever's continuing because the devil do have disciples. You don't know if they're not choosing that day to sacrifice and do different things. So you cannot, it's like. But I could take that same theory and put it in. And apply it. It can be any else. other day, but you don't know that day. Probably that's the day. Okay. So I don't like, know today's the day either. But it's like the same thing. Can somebody say Jesus was okay for Christmas? Can we say oh oh like God was not born on this day? He was born on a different I day. I cannot say that. I cannot say Jesus yeah. was born December twenty fifth. So, so the day oh. is this is the day that the Lord has made. Let, let us rejoice and be glad in it. What day was God that? made the day? What so day? the day itself has nothing to do with the belief of a few. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, that's 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 exactly that's what I'm trying to get at. It's I got like, you, dog. I can't, <laughs> I got you. I can't I got you. just... I, it's like, for real, for, if we're going to say Halloween is bad because of what we do and what the significance of it, then we can literally take that same argument and put it to... Apply it to, to, to every any day single day of the year. Because literally, mean, especially as Christians, we are very... The Bible is attentive to also not only just things of the physical realm, but of the spiritual. Correct. And of the spiritual, I don't know a day where the devil is not working. The devil all trying to holler at my dog... At me. Bit dog, I'm cool on that. <laughs> like, and I gotta, alone, I gotta die to the flesh. Yeah, from behind me, see? <laughs> like... I gotta die to my flesh daily. Daily. It's walking this Christian walk I got to do this daily. It's a daily thing. But then October 31st... I'm going to be like, oh, I'm going to up it. I'm going to up it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get I'm it. Up it. Don't, you, I don't get it. You're not going to let your kids go and get kids. Because nope. I feel like this is a day where it's like... that. that, that that's... I mean... It's God day. For them, that's their beliefs. Like I'm not discrediting but it could be a day that the dev, that they bring in sacrifices to the devil. Like they that, choose that's, that's, their, that's their thing. They that's bring their in thing. sacrifices every day. <laughs> no, every day. Is, you don't know that's why true. they choose that thirty first. I mean, you don't every, know. You they don't just know. Do it, they do the it in is, the masses on, on that. The that thing day. is, because yeah, because it's not only it's not only one household that's celebrating it. It's everybody. I believe it's the whole you, world that's doing it, right? I believe you only thinking that because October 31st, it's so famous. Correct. Literally, yeah. somebody can do this right now. Yeah, it's one like, of the famous People holidays. can really, like that That notion of what's done on or what, what, what believe is to have come about on October 31st, we only know that because of what's been spread down from that time to now. I think it what falls about on, the, on, on the top five. Yeah, right. but what about the what about other religions and other things that are not passed down to this day that people probably still practice still and practicing. we don't know about? Like you ever hear about like like say for example, um, um, the natives who be living in the middle of nowhere. You don't know what they're practicing to this day, and what they what what we can probably perceive of what we um practice on October thirty first. They probably not saying that they do. I'm just this is an example. Not not my fault to the natives. My fault. But this is just an example. I'm not coming for y'all. Yeah, I ain't coming for y'all. But like, who's to say that the Native Americans out in the middle of nowhere, where we don't see, are doing the very same thing that the people who did in October 31st are doing it, and they doing it every day. Who's to say that today is not the day of the dead for them? Today is not Halloween for them. We only, I feel like we could only say, like you can say that is because of what we just know today. But what about the things we don't know? Yeah. So if we're gonna if we're gonna take into account to, I believe we should always take into account the things that we don't know, not the things that we just know, because we don't know we don't know everything, and not every information was passed down. So when I believe of that, it's like okay, then that means for me, 
I'm not for if I'm not gonna dress my kids as nobody any day. If that's if that's the case, I ain't gonna dress them as nothing any day. No, don't don't be some be yourself. But you don't but you don't celebrate the day the death every day like America. I don't celebrate it at all. Day. But I'm saying they're not celebrating it every day. Just you don't know that. Day. You don't know that. But what we know, we can go about. I what can't we live know. by that. No, I cannot. <laughs> I cannot, <laughs> I cannot <laughs> live by that. Do you know? Both, I cannot live both, by that. Both of you guys are right. No, I'm all right. See what we no, said he about. Won, he I'm all right. See what we said about opinion. Like it can't be wrong. <laughs> it can't be wrong. But, but we gotta that, find but, this mutual ground but here. Does that answer the question? So should young Christians no, celebrate Hall- no, Halloween? No, 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 no. Did I, did I not just give you the Bible verse right now? No. <laughs> so you, what are we? What are we arguing about? No, we. we I, like, I was wondering. Fine. I was wondering <laughs> what's the difference between somebody putting up clothes, dressing your kids as a Disney princess. On October 31st and any other day. What's the difference? If you could do the same practices of Halloween any other day, why is it so bad the day of? And I understand that's, that. That's argument. my question. And I understand yours as well. Because if we, because me, <laughs> this is a podcast. We want to talk. We never talk. We just, I don't want to just tell y'all it's bad and let y'all okay. go. No. I want to talk. I'm going to tell y'all, don't do it. <laughs> All right? Like, that's, do not send your kids out to trick or treat, okay? If you are a Christian and you have, you have, you know, faith and and you read the Bible and you believe in the word of God. Do not send your kids out to trick or treat. Uh, if you are a church who want to uh, do something to counter uh, um, Halloween. Yeah. Apply what every other church has been doing for the past years, except I haven't seen it in this new yeah. generation. Which is Hallelujah Night. I don't think I ever right? been to a Hallelujah Night. You never been to a Hallelujah Night? I don't think so. Maybe you did as a Maybe as a kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah you probably don't remember. I don't remember. Yeah, it, it was that far back. Yeah. But <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> but, like, crazy. I, I would advise you, you know, as a parent myself, I'm, I'm not for dressing my kids up for Halloween and sending them out to trick or treat. I can buy candy for my kids anytime, any day, anywhere. Right, anytime, right. I don't have to do that on October thirty first. But that's celebrating death, though. You know, like I, don't, I don't gotta <laughs> oh do that on October thirty first. You know what I mean? No. Okay, so you went too far. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. not, if we can't do it October thirty first, we can't do it at all. What I'm saying, I could buy candy for my kids anytime. Oh, so buying my candy for my kids? Not celebrating no, right, the like, death. Yeah. Candy is, nah. on the day of Halloween is, is celebrating the death. What? No, this is... <laughs> Am I wrong? Yes, you are. No. If we're going to say dress it up, go to the door, trick or treat, and you giving them candy, or you actually scaring them, is it's actually part of celebrating that, the death. That is one... Then don't do it at all. Don't do no, it at all. No candy. No, no candy. candy. I'm gonna have, no candy. Hey, you're going to have some but healthy kids. candy, that's no issue, though. That's celebrating the death, though. No, so, so that so that goes nah, back to nah, my nah, no, so that goes back nah, to my first nah, first question. You, you oh, a little bit no, no, no. But that goes back to my first question. Uh, what is celebrating the death? Okay, you know what? what you know what? I'm gonna agree with you when you say we don't know. You don't know what they be doing. What's celebrating the death? Because death? just because know. one house is like I'm because the thing is I feel like you know with the trend everybody just wanna follow. It's like it's really cute to decorate my house because they don't know the meaning of it. Maybe they don't know the meaning of it and they're just decorating their house and giving out candies. But you don't know if a group of people out there is doing sacrifices because you know why people are dying. I mean, mm-hmm. people do die every day, but you don't know why this kid just ate a candy. Yes, it could have something in it, but probably did not have anything in it and they just died because of the that stuff happens, that we that don't know. Day. Yeah, that could happen every yes, day. Yes, but so, the sacrifice but that goes, on the that day shit. is not but, a but that goes the back to the, the initial hot, okay, question. Okay, 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 <laughs> what okay. is celebrating the death? Go after that. What's that? You're gonna have to no, ask them, you. though. Like, you're gonna have to Google like everybody else. Yeah, maybe. That's doing it that right now. Hey, shout out to my dog, Marta. <laughs> Help me out. Matter of fact, as y'all talk, I'm gonna touch it out. Hey, I want to hear it in the comments. Come on, chat GPT. Like, Please, because sure. breezy. Look, I don't know. I want to know why like, you celebrating it. I don't care, man. Any nobody can convince me it's to a, allow my kids, uh, my cult? kids to celebrate Halloween. Like, you can't convince me of that, man. I'm not buying candy. Like you know, uh, my wife, my wife just said you know to to, to buy the candy the day before. <laughs> <laughs> so there's no association between the candy and Halloween, you know. Well, <laughs> <laughs> test what one you, two, test one two. What you got, bro? So according to Chat GPT, you feel me? That's my dog. My dog GPT said, 
Celebrating the dead is a tradition found in many cultures around the world where True. people honor True. and remember those who have passed away. Mm -hmm. These celebrations mm. often focus on paying respect, keeping the memory of the deceased alive, and expressing culture or religious beliefs about death and the afterlife. Mm -hmm. Some well-known examples, uh, Dia de los Muertos. Y'all know about that. <laughs> the day, that's the Day of the Dead. Also, they um, open. That's in Japan. And all the other stuff. So it's like, if if I'm going to take celebrating the dead as what that paragraph said at face value, just focusing on paying respect, keeping the memory of deceased alive and expressing culture um, and religious belief about death and the afterlife, then I'm not going to lie. I don't really see nothing too bad about that. I don't see, I don't see nothing bad about keeping the memory of a friend that passed away or paying respect to my dog that passed away. I mean, there's nothing... I mean, I don't, I don't think something is bad with it until, like, you take your focus from God and you just become an idol. Or just, like, you celebrating this person. Of course. That's 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 playing one-on-one wrong. <laughs> I understand that. <laughs> that's wrong. That's but, thing, but you don't know if that's not But the thing doing. is... But, I'm, but the main question I'm just trying to figure out is what is celebrating the dead? If celebrating the dead is just trying to pay respect to somebody that passed away that was dear to you, then... But it is, since we call it like it's a devil's holiday. The devil's Who is we? My, I don't call it that. <laughs> the devil's very deceitful. What makes Tradition, you think that, religion tells you that. <laughs> what, religion tells what me. What makes you think that just just because we think it's something very nice, how, you know, Chad Tibichi just put it for us, that's what's behind it. Like, there's not a bigger meaning behind it. We don't know that. I understand that. So, again, but that goes as far as trying to figure out what is it. If we don't know it, then that means maybe buying the candy, dressing up is a faction is, is a factor of celebrating the dead. So that means you not it's not only bad to just do it on 31st, but it's bad to do it in general. So don't do it at all. Buy candy. Caleb, I know you don't eat candy. No, I'm saying no, I'm not I'm not saying buying I'm 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 just trying to like build a point. If we're gonna say, because the main thing is trying to figure out what is celebrating the dead. If we're going to say what we do on Halloween, like trick-or-treating, dressing up, all that stuff is what celebrating the dead is, then why is it only bad to celebrate the dead on the 31st, but it's okay to celebrate the dead any other day? If we're going to say these specific steps, dressing up, buying candy, saying trick-or-treat, all this stuff is bad and called celebrating the dead, then that means we should not be doing this at all. Because the reason why I agree to what, what, what your point is, is this, right? Because I think the idea came about to make it okay mm -hmm. for people not to question it, mm -hmm. right? Because it's candy and it's costumes candy. involved, Chilling. so it's a celebration. So that can be relatable to every kid, right? Yes. Like a kid will watch a cartoon and they 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 want to be like Tarzan, and that's the they, day they to want, be. You know, they want to be like Thor and and Superman, and then mm -hmm. you see all these fighties out there, you know. So it's relatable. So in order for us to get everybody to not look at it, oh my God, the devil schemes, right? The same like, thing I just said, but okay, you said it in a pretty English. Go ahead. What you said? <laughs> you oh, man. Did she just my accuse woman. me of know. taking her words? Yeah, she did. You go know, back, right? go back to the so legal. Assignment. The devil schemes. He uses these things that l appeal to be pretty innocent. You know, without flaws, without, you know, agree? so then those who don't know fully, right, will say, there's no, that's not a big deal. I you agree, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> dip oh and dab -o. But if that's the case, <laughs> then don't, don't do it, it at all. At all. <laughs> that's why I said I agree all. with you. <laughs> Thank you. you know, <laughs> don't, do don't do it at all. So don't celebrate Halloween. Don't, and don't, don't do it. Don't do it any day. Don't do it. You don't know, just your kids up. Yeah. Don't buy them candy. If, if we but know, everybody do it every day. Though. Everybody just do it like that one day. That's where I just do it one day. You know, I was trying to say it's like bad. I feel like it become a. Is it ritual? Is that the word? A ritual? No, I, well, I'm not sure what you're trying to well, say. Hold up, let me let me use. Chat I feel TV. like if we gonna <laughs> say you. if, if you're gonna say it's only well. bad on this specific day, then I believe that that opens a lot of questions, and, and I feel like we start to look like religion. Correct. If we're going to say it's just only bad on this day, we look like religion. That's true. That's In true. my I, opinion. I, I agree with you on that one. We look like religion. I, said, I think 
31st become a ritual, like a ceremony, is like where they do. It's exactly that. That's what I'm saying. Like, like if some it, people but, just do it on that day, not everybody just say, okay, I'm, today I'm gonna. No, if he, so the point is, some people are doing it, don't even care about the meaning, the meaning behind, behind it. it. Yes, they're doing it because it looks good and it's trending and it applies to the masses. Mm-hmm. That, that, that's why you know, they the do the same thing I said guys if you guys go back you know what I'm gonna stop I'm gonna stop talking <laughs> I'm gonna stop talking regardless if you said it you still not you still not making up what I'm trying to say okay if, if that's what you said oh my god is, okay. is trick or treating is dressing up as a character bad to do it any other day it is okay you don't do it at all <laughs> I don't even need to go back up I think the big question he gonna cut this off I think the big question is does it bring glory to God because there's a verse that says, first Christians 10, verse 31, whether you eat or drink, or whatever, whatever you do, do it for the glory of God. Do it all for the glory of God. So definitely, it's a strong no. <laughs> <laughs> so it does not bring the verse of God. <laughs> it's a strong no. It, it does not, right? Don't do it at all. Don't do it at all. It's a strong no, right? So, yeah, don't do not do it. <laughs> like, I don't know what say. Halloween don't do it. Not, don't do it. All right. So with that being said, uh, yes. let us know what no you candy. think. <laughs> let, us know. <laughs> let us know what you think in the comments. Like we would really want to hear from you. Yes. So I'm please let curious. us know in the comments. I know there's gonna be split here. Not well. I hope not from the Christians. I don't mind. But I, Long whatever. As, whatever comment. <laughs> it feels good. You could be. You know, but um, we would like to hear, it. and my dog dad's gonna get on y'all and, and respond to you guys. You know, comment. I might join her too. You know, <laughs> I, <wanna see. laughs> I think we should do a, a a retake of this once Halloween is done. Mm, We're gonna go live. Back. How about that? So, based on the response that we get from this video, we going live on Halloween. Yeah. Based uh, after on the Halloween. response, they based, on, response, based on, on the response, we gonna go live after Halloween. How about that? And then you guys could. You know, chat with us live online. Let's go. Yeah. All good. right. So this been a take of tap to tap to tap. Tap, tap in. in. No Halloween around here. Not at all. Not here. <laughs>